Hello, and welcome back to Farm Simulator 2013. In the year 2013, I'm the Gray Gamer, and it's January 27th, 2013. As you can see, uh, I broke down and got the baler. So, let's go ahead and get uh, going on this. Turn on the baler. and let's go I just couldn't uh, handle seeing this uh, straw go to waste and I mean I know that uh, it cost me a lot of money but uh, I'm okay with it so uh We'll pay it back because what we're going to do is we're going to sell all the bales that we get. So, unload bale. Hit X. All right, first let me. Let me uh, that back up. Hit X. Oh. Oh. No. Round bell. <laughs> it's alright. I got a plan for that, people. I'll show you what I mean. Because one of the benefits of a round bell is you don't have the problem that you have with the square bail. And that is everything that goes in comes out. And uh, so we just have to go along here. And as soon as that thing starts beeping, we unload that bad boy. That's not too bad. Actually, I like the turning radius on this better. Okay, I'm getting a little bit crazy here. Let me see if I can move to the side here. Nice stop. Hit X. Hit X. Nice. Close it. And go again. All right. Well, um, I have a stacker, folks. Uh, I got a round stacker. It's a uh, mod uh, that you can get. And uh, I downloaded it, and it's a stacker that you use for specifically for round bales. So uh, we'll be all right. If I look and learn to drive, or the hay, we'll be really good. So uh, I'll bring that out here in a second. Let me go ahead pop out another roll here and then I'll bring out the loader the 
round bale roller. Loaded. There we go. Come on, right to the end, right to the end, right to the end. Come on. There we go. Back up just a little bit. out of the way here okay so this is the round baler machine and uh, I've never used it so this will be our first time um, basically we put it in the operating position and uh, let's go it looks like it operates pretty much like the other one in that you pick them up, you drive by them. Let's see here. Okay, it picks it up. Oh, and it moves it down the line. Okay, good. Looks like it holds seven. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see how it unstacks. I think it tips up and stacks them up uh, on the flats, on their flat side. So nice. I don't know about you guys, but I like it. All right, I'm gonna cut the video here and then. Uh, I'll be back after we've got this uh, field finished, and uh, and then we'll unload the stacker and see how it, how it works. I'll be back. Okay, I'm back, and uh, I sped up time a little bit because I wanted to uh, get to daylight so you can see this. But um, I'm finished, and as you can see, the round baler has 95% full and um, I'm going to try to see if it will let me kick it out nope it doesn't give me the option but the nice thing about this is that hay or that straw in there is not going to go to waste because we can uh, pull this tractor off to the side um, park it and uh, no matter what we plant over here that gives us straw we can finish up and get a bale right away. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to just park that there. Alright, let me run over here real quick to the tractor with the, uh, that looks nice. Oh, by the way, you can see that a little bit better now. All those bales sitting out on that field. Um, whoops, sorry. But you see what I mean? And the nice thing about this is, uh, I don't know, to a farmer, that just looks totally sexy. So, um, but I want to show you a little something I figured out on my uh, individual game, too. Now, I can't do this with the um, round bells, but you can with the uh, square ones. Or, I mean, you can't do this with the square ones, but you can with the round ones. Look at that. I'm actually rolling it. So, uh, yeah, you can actually uh, move them around a little bit. Um, but uh, anyway, so that's cool. Um, let's go ahead and jump in our tractor and let's load this up and uh, see how many we've got. Put the light on the back like that. There we go. That way we can see the, see the machine. All right, let's go ahead and pick these up. See if I got mine to go out. Close enough. There we go. Snag it. So we got four on there so far. I think you can go any speed, actually. But okay, this is 
three. As long as it goes, finishes its process, I think you're okay. Okay, so we got room for one more. All right, so now we want to uh, hit B again. All right, that folds that up. Okay. Now we'll take it back here to the This is going to be the fun part. You guys get to watch me try to back that, back this up into the, and I got to remember that the back, okay, I like how I got that, oh, that's pretty close, let's see. <laughs> yeah, this is the fun part. Okay, I gotta get that around. I gotta bring it around. Ah. <laughs> Alright, let me pull forward. There we go. I don't know how close I actually have to be to the thing for this to work. Am I even close to the door? Yeah, kind of, huh? If I can line it back up, I'll be alright. Let's back this up and see if we can, I mean, let's pull this up, there we go, now let's see if we can back it up, don't start kicking on me, don't start kicking on me. Okay, let's try this anyway. Unload bells is O. Okay, so it goes through the same process that the other one does. All right, let's see if we can back up. Uh, Unload bells here. There they go. Why wow, did one just fly up? Oh, what? What? <laughs> okay, we sold. We sold some bells. <laughs> we sold some bells. Okay, let's <laughs> lower the platform. Wow. Um, I don't know how many popped off the the top there. One, two, I see three, so we sold five. <laughs> wow. Okay. Maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Boy, I, was, I don't know. I thought I was doing pretty good. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Not funny in the sense that it happens to me, but 
funny that stuff like that always happens to me. Oh, man. All right, hopefully we can <laughs> pick these up. If not, I'm going to be pushing them. But it looks like all of them but that one uh, fell in a position where next, I don't know if I can get that one or not. Thing I didn't get stuck. Oh. oh, now you back up nice and smoothly. Yeah, okay. I see how it is. I see how it is. Okay, let's try this. Uh, pick up this one. Okay, so it looks like maybe uh, if we're going to keep this one, which we are, um, in order to sell them. To uh, not stack with high. Okay, let's see if we can back this one into position. close I have to be actually be in there. Let me try something. Let me, uh, let me pull forward here and see if we can unload this outside the building and see if it will let us. Okay, because if we can put it, if we can put them there, unload them there, and uh, let's try that. Nope. Okay, so that didn't help us. Now what do we do? Well, we got it done. Okay, so my evaluation of it. I like it. Um, that That's a little bit problematic uh, unloading there. But I wonder if it would be the same with the other one anyway. I've never tried to unload um, uh, the square one uh, when it was full over here. Um, and it might do the same thing. I don't know. If you know, um, leave it in the comments. Um, Tell me what you think of this one. But, um, yeah, we made uh, 14, we had 4,000, so we made 10,000. So, uh, just so you guys will know that I'm doing what I said I was going to do, and now we're paying it down. We owe 110,000. But we'll get that paid off. I still got more bales out there to pick up. Um, but we're going to call, call our episode here. And, um, Thank you for checking us out. Uh, I'm the Gray Gamer, and this is Farm Simulator 2013 in the year 2013 for January 27th. Thanks again for stopping by, and we will see you tomorrow.